quiet, this is actually one of the quietest mods you can do. <laughs> it's just pops like that. It's just ones like that that take you by surprise. What's going on everybody, it's Brown here, back at it with another video and welcome back to Proving Auto. So recently guys, you will have probably seen uh, that I took a trip over to Performance M in Manchester to have a Scorpion GPF and Resonator Delete fitted to my M240i. So today is a little bit of a follow-up video really uh, because there's actually a few little bits like uh, in comfort mode and sport mode, uh, what the exhaust actually sounds like, um, you know, in them, them sort of modes. I never actually included that the day because it, of course it was, you would probably seen it was absolutely throwing it down with rain at the time. So uh, a little bit of a better today, day today. So uh, just gonna, as I say, a bit of a follow-up video because um, now I've had a few weeks to actually uh, live with it and uh, actually let you guys know uh, whether it was actually a good move or a bad move. What it's actually like to uh, live with on a day-to-day -day basis and stuff like that. So yeah, I think what we'll do now, I'll uh, add a few clips in now uh, on what the exhaust sounds like in comfort mode and then uh, I'll do a few clips on what it actually sounds like in sport mode. <laughs> So of course, as you probably just heard, uh, comfort mode, i.e. valves closed, is uh, pretty much what the car sounded like uh, before the GPF filter was deleted. And of course, in sport mode or sport plus, uh, i.e. valves open, well, pretty much what it sounds like now, really. So all in all, it isn't too bad. You know, what, what I do actually love about it, you know, you can have it in comfort mode and it doesn't pop and bang, it doesn't, you know, doesn't do anything like that. And, uh, you know, it's just nice and civilized. Uh, and then when you put it in sport, sport plus, when you want it to be a little bit louder, you know, you can uh, you can have that, uh, you can you can have it popping and banging, and, and I, I will admit as well, the pops and bangs are insane on this. Uh, as you will hear in a minute when we get out on the road, and uh, and uh, you guys can then see what it is like on the move, because it is, as I say, it is pretty insane to be honest with you. So uh, yeah, I think let's jump in the car, and uh, I'll show you guys what it sounds like on the move. <laughs> So, I suppose to answer the question then, do I regret fitting a GPF delete to my M240i? No. <laughs> of course I don't. <laughs> I think, um, yeah, I mean, I was a little bit worried to begin with because, um, you know, I didn't, want, I didn't know if it was going to be a little bit over the top. Um, but as, I, as, as I've just mentioned, what I do love about it is that, you know, in comfort mode, it is just like a normal car. You know, it's pretty much as it was before, uh, before I got the GPF delete fitted. Now, actually, another thing I forgot to mention is uh, another word for the GPF is the OPF or the PPF. Now, uh, um, for those who haven't seen my video uh, when I went to uh, get the job, when I, when I actually went to get the job done, um, basically, uh, what it is, it's uh, a newish filter that is fitted to um, all new cars these days. Okay, so anything sort of like post, post 2018, uh, unfortunately has this fitted now what it does is uh, just basically just ruin the sound to any car out there which is which is actually a real shame because as i mentioned before the b58 engine is a lovely sounding engine and uh, unfortunately due to uh, new regulations that uh, new cars have to comply with um, it just completely um, just completely deafens the sound of it um, but just 
it's just well I mean I'll put it in sport mode now uh, you guys probably can't hear I'll put the window down a bit <laughs> it's just insane and of course according to performance M um, which is of course the company I use to um, get this job done According to them, this is actually a quiet. This is actually one of the quietest mods you can do. <laughs> it's just pops like that. It's just ones like that that take you by surprise, and uh, it just completely trans. It just completely transforms the sound of the car. Close the window now. I'll leave it over in a little bit, but uh, yeah, yeah. It just completely transforms the car. It's. <laughs> And uh, the thing is as well, when you guys heard, and actually if you guys haven't seen the video yet of me actually going to uh, Performance M to get it done, you know, definitely do check the video out because it really is worth a watch. Um, because of course, and I've, I've sort of explained a bit more of the process about having it done, which I'm not going to mention because I've already covered it. But, <laughs> but yeah, but yeah, as I said, but then, um, you know, you can have it back in comfort again. And it's just a normal car. So, you know, uh, one thing I will say is that it is a bit louder on um, cold starts. That's to be expected. Uh, but it does it does simmer down very, very quickly. That's, uh, that's one thing I do love about it. I'm going to have to put that light on because uh, we're losing light very, very rapidly. So, yeah, it's, um, that's just, just one thing I absolutely love about it. You know, you can either have it, you can either have it popping and banging, which sounds amazing. I'm not going to lie. Or, um, oh yeah, you can uh, you can have it uh, you can just have it civilized, you know. So you know, if you if you're down if you're down uh, a street and you know your neighbours are a little bit funny, then you know that's fair enough. But uh, to be honest with you, as soon as these days, as soon as the car is up to temperature, then it goes straight into sport mode. If I'm being honest, so yeah, it's just absolutely amazing. If anyone actually. Um, has a GPF filter and, and one thing I will say is that uh, the part I had fitted will also fit pre-GPF models because uh, it's basically the same part you know it's basically uh, a straight through pipe all the way from the cat to the back box so I've kept the standard um, I've, I've kept the standard um, cat in place basically uh, I mean originally I think eventually uh, I'm going to go for a sports cat probably when I probably because when I eventually tune this car which i'm planning to uh, so make sure you are subscribed guys because um uh, not soon but you know in, in the future i will be um i will be uh, tuning the car so uh, definitely subscribe so you can keep up to date for when that happens but uh, but for now i'm just you know i just it's just absolutely awesome you know i love uh, it's just one of them f sort of things I, I thought i wish i'd got it done just biblical it really is so i suppose what it's like to live on a day-to-day -day basis well you know it's as, as i've mentioned before it's, it's absolutely it's absolutely fine you know it's it's not too loud it's not droney it's nothing like that it's it's uh, just awesome but yeah that's uh, i think that's going to be it for this video guys just a little uh, just a little bit of a uh, really a follow-up video to uh, the one that i've done previously um, with the uh, GPF delete. So, uh, nonetheless, guys, hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please do smash the like button. It is always appreciated. Also, consider subscribing for more stuff like this in the future. And if you do that, do not forget to hit the bell icon. Make sure you turn on all notifications so you don't miss out on a single thing to come. Okay, so until next time, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you look after yourselves, stay safe, and I will see you all very soon.